Hi folks, today we're going to have a look at a series of tutorials on Photoscape X. It's a free editing software, so I'm going to cover just the basic editing, some cropping and some composition. Let's get started. Welcome to this tutorial. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to create sliced images for Instagram using Photoscape X. Uh, with the previous tutorials you would have seen I've saved the images in different sizes and this one specifically is at the bottom you can see the file name is slice2 uh, we're going to click on that and we're going to have a look at it in viewer basically the next step would be right click on it split and we're going to have a look how many columns and how many rows we're going to have one so there we have the um, uh, precursor to um, the image we go split and we're going to save the location in the current folder and we're going to save at a hundred percent because the original image is already downsized we go OK and there you can have the image close and if we pop into our finder oh sorry wait we just pop into the desktop we have a look uh, let's open, there we go, slice 2 and 3, and there's our slice 1 and our slice 2. So there we have our two images ready to rock and roll. Let's go back to the Photoscape software and we'll close that window and there we'll have a look at this one. As you can see now it's showing you the two images. We click on the one we'd like to slice in 3. We we'll make sure it's in viewer, right click, split. We want three columns. We want one row. We go split. We got it a hundred percent because we're already using a resized file. And we go OK. And there the three files are. So if we pop back out of Photoscape, we go look in Finder. There's the first one, second one, third one. Guys, it is that simple. And I'm sure now you'll be able to uh, enjoy putting uh, unique photos onto Instagram. Thanks very much for following this tutorial. And we look forward to any comments and any suggestions in the comments below. Thank you very much.